Hey everybody, welcome back to the farm. Today we're on a road trip. We're heading up to Gordon Bright's farm for him to try to run that pad washer that we built and y'all came along and watched with us. So make sure y'all hang around, hit the thumbs up for us, subscribe if you haven't so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. And let's get up here and see how this 2,000 gallon washing machine works out. Gordon's already got it set up. Got it hooked to there. What's this, a C70? Let's see if we can open it up and see what the pads look like. There's what the nest pads look like. Good deal. Well, we got the water cut on. Y'all can hear the water going. And keep your fingers crossed. We're going to see what she does. If not, that's a lot of pads for me to wash by hand for Gordon. I hear the water going. Yeah, there it goes. Get some water flowing in it. y'all we ran it for five minutes or so and ran into a little issue we're working on getting a new keyway and the new grade eight bolts put in it kind of in a panic here not a panic we're in a hurry because gordon's on a deadline with this turnaround but we should get it here we're working on getting a new keyway made to go right there to put in and we'll bring y'all back in just a few minutes all right we got it put together with the keyway the new grade eight bolts went to start it up and it just flat out it broke that new gear in half can y'all see that just flat out pulled it in half with the tractor just above idle we think what the problem is, is that when we loaded them pads in there, they was dry with the manure. Then once we wet it, we shouldn't have stopped it. We stopped it to try to tighten the chain up because it was a new chain. And now when you try to start it, it's when it's giving us trouble. So I think we're gonna try to find a gear if we can. Maybe cut, pull some of them out. It's a learning process as we go in and Gordon's on the timeline here, a short turnaround on the house this time. So we might have to go back to his old one here to finish this turnaround and do some more experimenting on it. But I sure do appreciate y'all watching and supporting us here at Gerald Farms. Have a good one. <laughs> 